I've got to, I've got to congratulate you, by the way, uh, on your incredible ratings. Number one broadcast, what? <laughs> Amazing. Since you Peter know, Jennings, funny. Yeah, since Peter Jennings yeah. and, and and you know, I remember walking into ABC when I was the rookie correspondent, anchoring the overnights, and Peter Jennings was still the anchor. And I remember uh, my family had come to town, and they, they took this photograph of me uh, oh. outside ABC, and I was so proud of my my getting landing Peter Jennings oh at the gosh. bus stop right there behind me. Oh. Um, and that's as you know the entrance to ABC. Yeah, so of course. I just thought, yeah, can you can we just uh, you know? And I, I still remember. Uh, when Peter Jennings would anchor the news and then it would air in the different time zones, there'd be somebody who would stay in the building as the standby person. And, and pretty quickly, about a week in, they, they assign me to do that. And after the news is done, he'll say, you know, um, who's the standby tonight? And I get a phone call, come down to the edit room. And I thought, oh no, I've already ticked off Peter Jennings. So right. I come down to the edit room and they play it for me. And you see Peter, he said, you know, have a good evening, good night. So the show's over and now he says, who's the standby? And you hear the floor director and he says, David who? And I thought, oh, that's funny. They're right. trying to point out that he has no idea who I am. Right. But then they say David Muir, and he said, he's the chap on the overnights. He's quite good. Oh, my God. By the way. <gasps> so that plays on loop in my office. All yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, now, yeah. he's now the chap on that bus stop as well. Oh, that's right. Tonight, yes. Wait, look at that. We have a photo of oh. you right there. Coming full circle. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. You know, you, get, mean, you get out of the subway, and you are reminded, though, um, of the privilege and the honor, honestly. And I still remember walking in there like it, it was the first day of a first day of school. And, and you walk in with a dream and um, that was, it's been- Well, you make us feel safe. Yeah, you, yes, you know? 100%, you deserve it. You deserve it, you're a hard worker. Congratulations.